So this is the life of Sir Balin. Yes, we've had a lot of silly mods recently. I think we. I think it's time to do a serious one. Sir Balin is dead, yet still he lives. Oh, that's good. Find his journal and begin the journey to discover the life of Sir Balin. You must follow the clues left in his journal to find all the pieces to his armor. Oh, he's got a whole armor set we get to hunt? That's yes. awesome. Only in the end will you be deemed worthy of knighthood yourself. It has a slight tie-in to his Oblivion webcomic that he, he created and updates pretty regularly. So in order to not be completely left out, go to that link to get yourself up to speed. Oh, man. Oh, it's missing. Let's see if it's on the Wayback Machine. It is. Oh. 2007. Oh my god. Oh my lord. Black text on dark blue background. Oh my god. Oh, it looks All like the, we, yeah, it didn't save the thing. Oh. The images are gone. Well, we won't know the context of this guy's uh, OC Oblivion universe. So we have to go and find Sir Balin's burned down house. Yeah. Where we're going is to Lake Popad, right? Which is right next to the haunted house and Nagastani. Oh my, what the hell? So we're going to we're going to uh, we're going to Nagastani. One of these days we're gonna get just overlapping. I feel like this uh, this rain is very atmospheric for this quest. Going through an old knight's life. How poorly written do you think it's gonna be? I hope it's well written. I mean, if you're making a webcomic, it's got you, you got to be somewhat literate, right? I mean, this was a webcomic in the early 2000s. Fucking mm. everyone had a webcomic. That is true. And it also was a gaming webcomic, so... Ah! Is that it up there? Fuck. Mud crab. There we are. Burned one burned out hoose. Man. Go find his journal. I'm surprised that his his journal survived a, a house fire and completely destroyed his house. Yeah, you would have thought that the journal would be the first thing to go up in flames. Oh, there. there we go. Surveillance journal, strange key. Holy shit! Okay. Where do we go next? By the time you're reading this, I'm already gone. Good. In fact, the whole purpose of this journal, this last. At this piece of my life is for me to pass on my duties I so nobly held. However, these duties <laughs> came with a price. You must forfeit your life for the betterment of society. Oh shit. If you feel that you may be able to live to the esteem that is to be expected from a protector of the helpless, you must def uh, seek out the impossible flower. The next step will be revealed to you within the rock below. Blah, blah, blah. I'm a very sad knight a and I'm dying and gotta be good and you're gonna pick up my armor okay go to the river got it a rock down by the river it's probably that rock right there there's yeah. the impossible flop oh we got a shield good Ooh. See a lot of rain in this the shield will very useful tool when used correctly you can effort 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 effortlessly keep yourself from harm <laughs> Unlike the sword, it acts as protection to whomever it serves. Fuck if you haven't caught God on to my analogy yet, the shield is you. Oh, blah, 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 function, protect them from any folly. I realize I cannot stop a person from fighting my treasures. Uh, wisdom and knowledge. Wizard. If you travel east from Bruma, you'll find it overlooking the ruins of Sador far below. Okay. If you have chose to not complete the final mission, you'll be marked by having to carry all heavy pieces of my armor. It doesn't have any as weight. As well as its sword and shield for the duration of your life. Okay. Travel east from Bruma. Cave of the Earth. This is when Elder Scrolls games are at their best, when you're kind of just walking somewhere that you need to go. Yeah. 
just sitting on a walk on and kicking your feet up. Just listening to the music and walking through the environment. As soon as you have to fight something, you just get pulled completely out of the game, but this is good. God, goblins! Ah! That looks like it. The cave of the earth. Open with the old key. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, God. Oh, there's a minotaur. a minotaur. Oh, God. This guy's very tough, isn't he? Holy shit. Ah! Oh, a piece of shit. Can you can you wreck all him with the Tenebrous' stat? God damn right I can. Think that's funny? Take this. You big minotaur bitch! <laughs> yeah! Oh, look oh. at that. He didn't even know what oh, yeah. hit him. Yeah, the key. Oh, there's shit. another one. Some more. This one's smaller. Fuck you! Oh, oh, there's two. <laughs> Fighting a lot of minotaurs. This is the minotaur cave. Cave of the earth, obviously. Okay. Ooh, this looks like where you need to go. A teleporter? Where do you think you put the key in? To? Uh. Oh, jeez! Like... Oh, friend? Nope. Okay. Oh, he's friend. a bad man. Yeah! Oh, he's got a lot of health. Yeah, he does. It's fine, Scub. Can... And he does a lot of damage. Good lord. Scub's gonna have to use all of his powers to overcome <laughs> this, this encounter. Oh, yeah, you oh, got Oh, jeez. Oh, there we are. Get dumpstered. Yeah, so we're gonna get the next armor piece, I guess? Look at how big this fucking one. chest is. It's huge. Maybe he's not good in it. Oh, we got his longsword next. We got his sword already? Custom model? It does. Well, no, it doesn't. Ooh. But it has a custom texture. Looks very it cool. Looks cool. Alright, we got part Oops. three. Let's see. Oh my um, god, there's seven fucking pages. Uh, she was beautiful. I soon I soon lost track of time and enveloped myself with her day and night. We <laughs> fucked and fucked. And fucked, and fucked and some more. Fucked. And then tragedy struck, and they did not like me boning a dark elf. I I was fucking a dark elf, and they did not like it. Stuck between land and the western sea. In the welcoming jet of land, she will ever be. Very close to where the hammer fell, and farther north than where its anvils dwell. Okay. Do you know where that is? Um, uh, anvil's here. I guess we're gonna have to go and follow the around. entire coast of Cyrodiil north of Anvil. Let's go. Hopefully, we can breathe underwater long enough to go check out a sunken ship. What is a uh, Scub's breath holding ability like? Might have a potion of water breathing. We do not. Good. Uh, le hopefully, there's a map marker near it because uh, if not. Uh, if we need water breathing, then I have a plan. Can't be that deep underwater that will suffocate, right? Good point. I better go get that water breathing. <laughs> we'll uh, be back once we get the water breathing. <laughs> what we gotta do is start the uh, Mage's Guild quest in Shade and all. Greetings, Red God. We should start doing that in real life. R whenever you <laughs> walk up to someone, just refer to them by their race. Greetings to you. Good day, Black. Oh, God. I want to join your guild. Thank you. Find someone else to bother, won't you? I will. Oh, right. Give me a recommendation. I'm ready. I was born ready. Without. Okay, thank you. Just look. Just give me buoyancy, please. Thank you. Be careful. Okay, now we can go do the thing. So, what does buoyancy do? Well, what else? Gives you water breathing. Very close to Hammerfell. Hell yes. Okay, good. So it's, uh... It's probably this, or this. I think it's that little spiral cove. It's gotta be. Yeah, I'm sure nothing was built on that. Oh my god, look at those mud crabs. It'll probably be the water dungeon, right? Where we'll have to go fight all the water things. Are we gonna have to do a fire and air dungeon as well? That would be so lame. May that might have been clever at one point, but now that's so lame. <laughs> Just doing so doing anything with like the four elements, and being like, "Oh, isn't that cool?" It's been very overdone. All right, there's our ship. 
Oh, we actually found it. It was it was at the spiral. So this is where old Paladin wanted to always visit then. Yeah, so it it doesn't make any sense that his boots would be here, but what the fuck? That's where it is. Well, it is the oh, water son dungeon. Of a fucking bitch. Oh god, it actually is a water dungeon. No. Oh. What the fuck? Oh. Is this it? Oh, is this That's going? it. Oh no, was we are going to have to get each peach individually. <laughs> was that it? Yep. That Did was we even it. get his journal? Yeah. Oh, yeah we got shit, journal 4. Okay. Hell yeah. How are the boot? How are the gauntlets? Using up all our hammers. We have tons of hammers. We got like 60 from <laughs> the game that show. That is true. The game show was uh, our five, best supplier. Seven! Ooh, date. what the f- Okay, those are- That makes me look like oh. Omni-Man from, uh, <laughs> Invincible. Yeah. <laughs> Do any of you fucking Zoomers get these mad references that I'm dropping? Is that it? Okay, that was fucking easy. That feels like a- That feels like that isn't the correct thing. Like, what oh, it's, it's just in this rock here. Like, it's not even in the boat. Yeah, I think it, it, it would be very hard to spot. If I'm stuck. Get yourself stuck. Are you kidding me? Wait a second. Oops. Disabe. <laughs> Disabe. Oh, that boat isn't even... He didn't even add the boat. It's... If you look at the top, you can see the ID starts with zero zero. That means it's a vanilla object. Okay, well there you go. Oh I'm my god! Surprised he didn't just put all the armor at once. Okay, oh, this is just a two pager. From Leowin, take the yellow road and, when it curves northwards, continue traveling to the east. There you will find the next task. Follow the sense of a I can't. I can't. This game doesn't have smell o vision. <laughs> Maybe he put in some smell particle effects. I miss I miss the clues from um, Fun Mission, you know. Instead of having to read a book to like and have to like figure out, okay, I go here and I need to look for this. Just saying, it's here. Is that my Eek the liar? Oh hell yeah! Oh, <laughs> here he is. Tell some. So much easier to get around these days. Not like the old days. Too much walking. Of course, nothing stops my eek from walking. Yeah, hear that, Morrowind Zoomers? Stop complaining about fast travel. My eek thinks it's it's cool. <laughs> it's got the my eek stamp of approval. Fast travel is A-OK. -okay. Oh wait, you know what? Let's, head, let's go back home and level up. Wait, what? We're, we're heading back home to level up. We got to level up. Are we up. almost there? No, I mean, we just got Dark Fathom Cave, so we can just fast travel back there. Okay. Sleep next to the, uh... Oh, shit. Sort of getchy moochy. What did you do? Uh... I think we're gonna the get waken up approaches. by the Dark Brotherhood. Because we killed that leprechaun. Oh, no. It's fine. I mean, it's... it's That's the recruitment process. You sleep oh, okay. rather soundly for Ooh. Oh, Lucy and Lachance. Yeah, yeah, How yeah, yeah. Did he... yeah. Did he no. climb all the stairs to our house? <laughs> yes. That, that's took, a long maybe way he portal. came up. Rufio to his death. Yes, yes, I'll kill Rufio. Maybe. If, if a mod wants us to do it. I, I don't- I can't even count how many fucking uh, games of Oblivion where I've just had the Blade of Woe in my inventory forever. Because <laughs> you just kill some random NPC. I kill someone, Lucy Lachance comes and is like, Hey, take this blade and ice this Nord. I'm like, yeah, okay, buddy, whatever. <laughs> I'll do that. Just leave the knife in your back pocket and forget about it. Oh, oh, I, I smell the ash. But this is the ash? Oh, yeah. Oh, God, it, it reeks. What is that? Oh! <coughs> oh, fuck, I inhaled some. <coughs> oh, jeez. You can taste it. It smells so strong. Oh, you can taste it. It is the elements. It's fire! We gotta do the air one after this. When Who does the four elements questline in the order of earth, water, fire, air? Yeah, you do earth, wind, fire, and then water. 
just like the bats. Oh, what the fuck? You did nothing. You didn't swing at me, you bitch. Get away from me. Hey, Zach, put Midi of Earth, Wind, Fire over you killing that flame at your neck. Okay. It edits itself. You know what would be funny? If the entire suit of Sir Balan looks like Omni-Man and it turns out that uh, <laughs> they stole it from this and they thought no one would <laughs> They find stole out. it from a 2006-2007 Oblivion mod? Yeah. And who's gonna like, oh you stole it from my mod for Oblivion that I released. Yeah, no one's gonna believe them. Yeah. I can't wait till we find Storm Atronax in the air place. That's gonna be fun. You're right. I think there's probably going to be an ice cavern as well that's going to have Frost Datramax in it. Yeah, maybe they go through the Pokemon elements. What do you think is going to yeah. be in the bug? Um, that's where you get the boots. He's going to oh, be like, Dear Diary, I stepped on a bunch of bugs. Ew, my boots are covered in gross bugs. And now a big bug has taken my boots and is wearing them on its <sighs> bug legs. Yeah, it's a millipede. It has no use for one pair of boots, but they... It's taking them anyway. But he wears it anyway. <laughs> to taunt me. He doesn't even wear it on his front pair of legs. It's like on his 37th pair of legs. It's like a completely random number <laughs> that he picked. But it's only 37 on one side. It's like 52 on the other, so they're off skew with one another. Alright, is it gonna be a big flame match? Or oh, this looks like a boss. Oh my god! Oh god! Oh god, oh god. Oh, god. Fire giant. Fire giant? Oh, this is not ideal. There's so much health. It just stun locks you. Oh, got boots. Okay. Oh, I oh you can just take the stuff. Oh, but can we escape? Oh, oh hell yeah, mind. we don't have to kill him. Maybe he leaves. Is he gonna come out too? God, I hope not. Fuck you, fire giant. Put up an old runescape fire giant JPEG. Uh, That's I, what that I can man find one. Have. <laughs> That's what that guy looked like. We should we should probably Rematch. finish him off. Round for quests two. For weird reasons. Yeah, maybe. Ah, fuck. What is my fucking agility that keeps doing? Point two is a dead. I also hate fucking stuff. It's not very fun. It's, it's not fun. It's Fuck. Ooh, this big bastard man. This is this potion that I got. Oh god, he's gonna get you. Oh, oh. Got him. holy shit, you have one HP. Airboats, yeah. All right, crack open that next journal. <sighs> journal number five. Holy fuck. Oh god. Uh, okay, they build towers with intense light emitting from the top. Out north of the Orange Road and north of the Elven Ruins, Miranda. I built a temple to honor the memory and wisdom. Okay, north of the Orange Road. Do you think that Sir Balin is, like, the superhero name? And the person turns into Sir Balin. Whoever wears the armor is Sir Balin. It's a, just a title that's passed down. Yeah, like Jason Bourne. Exactly. That was red. You know what I just realized, by the way? You know how every single time we've left the dungeon and we were on rocks? Yes. When we went to the water dungeon, I think we entered the exit. Because I think they, oh. they, he was hiding those teleporters in the rocks. Oh, and we accessed the back of the, the teleporter. Uh -oh. So we just skipped that. Oh, we can't. Oh. It needs a key. Uh oh. Did we miss a key somewhere? There we go, it's, we got it. Fucking weird door. I mean, you link the mod we do in every video description, don't we? Yeah. This is very dark for a uh, So it's like, if someone it. wants to read, if you want to read these these messages, you can download the mod and do it yourself. I need torches. Oh, stuff. God. Can we have a monster, please? There's no way we're gonna go through the fucking dungeon like this, Zach. You're out of your mind. <laughs> go get a torch. Okay. 2CF9F. <clears throat> 10. 
Ten torches. Oh, it doesn't light it up a whole lot. Oh, what a fucking maze. <laughs> yep, the maze of light. You know what? Has there been any game where someone's been like, oh, you know what my favorite part was? The maze. Oh, I love doing mazes. I hope the boss fight isn't in pitch darkness. <laughs> oh, you know it will be. Okay, zombies are... What the fuck? Oh god, there's two! Oh god, there's oh, three! No. Oh god, holy shit! So much for those other horror games. This is the actual spooky one. It's just a whole zombie party here. Where are there zombies in the oh, light no. temple? He's, he's gone. They're light guardians, apparently. Why would you pick zombies for that model, though? I, I don't- why would you have your light temple be completely pitch black? Because it's ironic that way. You have to use the light inside of you to light the way in the light temple. Oh, here we go. Boss room? Oh, Jesus. Yep, yeah, there it is. Light giant. That does a lot of goddamn damage. Holy. Fuck it. <laughs> I give up. I give up. Oh, yep, there it is. Greaves. Okay, Greaves. This Put is those neat. bad boys on. I like the candles. Remember Harry Potter? Next. You're gonna look like medieval Iron Man. <laughs> I took in a circle. He found that by using his method. And marking of twenty crates that go from what the Is this fuck? The first binary. I don't like this. I don't fucking like this. You'll find the temple in honor of his memory just inside the Elsewhere border with Cyrodiil in the West Wild. If you start at the corner where Valenwood and Elsewhere meet, you are sure to find it eventually. What do you mean eventually? Beware the wind! Oh, this is the Air Temple, of course. So we took a break from doing the elements to get the light slash darkness temple in there. So we start here. And I guess oh we travel God. the West Weald. There, but we go back home to level up. Lucy no chance isn't gonna come again, is he? God I hope not. Hey, have you killed that guy I told you to get yet? The clock's ticking, you know? He's about to he's gonna die of old age eventually. And then you'll look like an idiot. What's wrong? Has something gone missing? Yes. I think... What? Everything. I think it reset the contents of the fucking chests. Oh, no. Oh, that's fucking... Oh, that's bad. <laughs> hmm. I guess it, they weren't set to safes? Well, look who's an idiot now. I was dissing the, uh... I was dissing the game show houses. Looks like we're using those from now on. Oh damn it! I remember playing a Valenwood mod that would have a that had a path that just went up this big ass hill. And that was it? <laughs> no, it had more. Okay. But it, it also had that. Oh, I can't. Because people way. like their uh, people like their elves, man. Okay, I still have the border on. Fuck. Okay. Well, I'll be back. I think I said it before, but uh, durability? Don't miss it. Skyrim did a good nope. job getting rid of that shit. It's one of the good changes. Oh, but it's dumbing down the game, Zach. You're removing integral systems that increase the immersiveness of the RPG environment. Proper maintenance of your gear. Yeah, it's just maintenance. It doesn't add anything it doesn't it, it's more of like uh well in, in real life you would have to maintain your gear yeah but you'd also have to shit oh well <laughs> wait till you see what todd howard has in store for elder scrolls 6 fully immersive you have to shit you have to piss uh um, you thought people were impressed with the horse anuses from red dead redemption 2 well just wake for the graphically accurate shitting that's going to be in Elder Scrolls 6. 
Okay. He even gave the Argonians a cloaca. Oh, look at our house up there. Wow. Look at that buggy piece of shit house that deleted the cool bows that we got. Oh, oh looks like no. you gotta parkour up. Don't There's fuck a... it up. I don't even know if I have the acrobatics to do this. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Well, looks like we're cheating again. What's our acrobatics? Oh yeah, you can do this with ease. You know, you notice how Todd Howard what never went like, you know what? Jumping. What do you guys think? Puzzle <laughs> around jumping. Like what happens? That's one of the that's one of the highlights of our game. We've really developed the jumping system. I have a hundred acro okay, there we go. Jesus Christ. A hundred acrobatics? I can't get up there? Are you kidding me? Oh. <sighs> we, okay. When one, one is, right is right and none are left, which then is wrong? One may follow the path ahead, though none tread it as well. So which is right? One is. Listen to the stones. They speak of the truth. So we just have to trial and error it. Uh oh. There's a man. No, oh, thank you. See ya! <laughs> Air Guardian. Oh, he's weak as shit. Why is he the weakest enemy we found so far? Yeah, zombies Silver tough, Claymore. but this is just a dude. Oh! <laughs> See ya! Don't scare me, ghost. Big and binary. Binary. Binary, obviously. Oh, that's binary. Like, zero ones, but I don't give a fuck because there's only two rooms. Uh, God. Oh, got him. Oh, we get his helmet last? I guess so. The entrance to Diculo lies on an island in the upper Nibbon, somewhat close to the great bridge that spans across it. Sticky. However, your best chance would probably be to take the entrance through the grate. It lies between some rocks in the water around the island. May you avenge our souls. Mm. We're, we're going to find out that this actually has a really well-written story that we've just been ignoring. Yeah.